Just as suspected, you collect every single one. Hmm, I'm so impressed. I'd like to pass along very special knowledge to your dog. <gasps> Wait. Does this mean that he's gonna teach my dog to now start sniffing mushrooms? Hello everybody and welcome back to some more shenanigans to Sneaky Sasquatch. My name is of course Constantine and we are back. We are now on the tiny Sasquatch island here because as you guys can see right now the island is completely empty and there's nobody here to actually check out and uh, get some money from. So uh, this is going to be our mission for today but not only that. In today's episode I'm also planning to make my way to the uh, Mushroom Hunter just because I finished getting all the mushrooms. It has been a great journey so far but uh... Man, finding these mushrooms hasn't really been that easy. I mean, it's not really difficult to find them. It just takes a little bit of patience in order to do it. And if you guys are wondering how I did it because I didn't post any videos on it, uh, you guys can see that right now. Go down to the screen. I will make a quick guide on how to find all these mushrooms. But do keep in mind that finding these mushrooms, it's kind of randomized. You cannot really show the exact location and time where these mushrooms can be found. It's kind of similar to uh, what we had to do when we had to search for the dinosaur bones. Uh, it was pretty random and uh, you just had to be really lucky. Alright, well, that being said, uh, now let's just uh, make our way to the island, and I think I am going to do this by simply fast traveling, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, let's just go ahead and do a little bit of fast traveling here. And the reason I want to do this is because we are going to have to chat with the commander. Uh, we are going to have to figure out how to get ourselves the ferry, first of all, and then we are going to be able to get some people to our island. So, first thing is first, we have to go, like, right over here. There we go. Hey friends, would you like to be the substitute fairy captain tomorrow? Yes buddy, that's exactly what I want. Alright, so we're gonna be able to do just that. Hey, how's the boating license treating you? <laughs> Pretty fine, I guess. You're good, don't worry about it. So of course, now that we've done that one, uh, what we gotta do next is just uh, reset the day. But I will have to reset the day like right over here. There we go. Uh, before I go ahead and do that... Actually, yeah, let's just go ahead and get ourselves some sleep, reset the day, so that we can then start using the ferry. Alright, there we go, a brand new day has started. Let me just get this ferry to the island so that we can hopefully get some uh, customers over there, and then bring them to my island. And I think I'm going to do this three times in order to get uh, the island full, filled up with people. This really, this update is really interesting. I really enjoy doing this. Taking people to our island, then uh, just leaving them for a few days in order for them to just leave some money after they leave. It's really, really cool. I wonder how they leave though, because I'm definitely not taking them back. Alright, so look at that. We got a motorbike. Come on in, buddy. This guy has no idea we're gonna take him. <laughs> I'm curious that... Um, I'm curious if after we're gonna be taking quite a few of these fellas to our island, if the next destination is not gonna be just Marina and Islands, maybe the next destination is gonna start being... Tiny Sasquatch Island. That will be really cool. You don't got work tomorrow, buddy. Don't worry about it. You're actually going to be spending a lot of time in my camp. Alright. Alright, there we go. So, first customer is gonna be this fella. Next up, I am gonna go to the marina, of course, to grab me some more customers. Uh, did we hit something? Ah, don't worry, buddy, buddy. It was just a... There we go. Hmm, is a camper over there. I'd love to camp here. Eight days, look at that. What? I think this is currently the most somebody has stayed here. That is so cool. Alright, let's keep on going. Let me make my way to the marina next so that we can grab ourselves some more customers. Alright, there we go. Let's see what we're gonna get this time. Hopefully three people in the car. I wanna try to... Ah, uh, just one. That's okay. <laughs> Come on over, buddy. You're fine. Yeah, we definitely have enough uh, beds, but uh, unfortunately we're not getting enough people here, but that's fine. I do believe that you're getting the same amount of money. It doesn't really matter how many people are actually gonna try to come over and stay at your place. Ah, uh, look at this. This guy would pay a lot if he would eat a banana. And thankfully I do have one. Look at that. Is that a banana you got in your backpack? Yes! I'll buy for 751 points? What? Are you kidding me right now? Oh my god! Well, guys, if you are gonna do these ferry rides here, make sure you fill your backpack with absolutely everything you can find in the supermarket. Just at least grab one of each, and if these guys are gonna request it, look at this! 
751 coins. That is a lot. That is insane. What? Man, this update has been absolutely insane so far. I had no idea we we're gonna be getting so much. Wait, what? Nice fireworks? What fireworks? Did these guys just start a fire? <laughs> Where are we? Don't worry about it, buddy. You're fine. I'm gonna take you to a place you're never gonna forget. Let's just see what these guys were saying about the fireworks, though. Are there gonna be any fireworks on the island? That would be cool. Yeah, unfortunately, I don't see no uh, fireworks or anything, so I'm not quite sure what that guy was saying. Alright, so this guy's gonna stay seven days. That's fine. That is fine. But, man. $750 for one banana? That kind of blew my mind away, to tell the truth. <laughs> that was insane. Alright, and next up, for the funnel clients, let's see what we're gonna get. And we got... Three people in the van, look at that. That is what I wanted. Awesome. I really want to get, uh, I really want to try to get three people in the car every single time I'm going to go to the island. But uh, I don't know how lucky I'm going to be with that. But now we did. It's really unfortunate because if you are taking three people to the tents there, unfortunately there's only two beds in the tent. So I'm going to have to see how they're going to deal with that. Alright, so let's just take these guys to the destination. <laughs> I love how they think that I'm lost. Of course I'm not lost. I'm doing this uh, intentionally because I want you guys to sit on my island. I don't care about uh, what you gotta do tomorrow or anything else. Look at that. This guy could eat a taco. See, if you also have a taco on, that guy's probably gonna pay a lot of money. Hmm, this doesn't like the marina. Oh, is that a campground? Alright, so they're gonna stay... Seven days. There we go. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Hmm. I wonder what's gonna happen if you actually keep on bringing people here. That may be really interesting. I think I'm also going to have to bring my truck here just to try to get rid of these uh, pile of wood, the pile of wood here. Uh, we definitely don't need to have this pile of wood on this island. Uh, because I'm pretty sure we're not going to have to build up anything anymore. But, uh, as you guys know, we did have quite a few people staying up at our place here. Let's just check the reviews. I never kept anywhere else again. I ate a mustard from the cooler. It was great. Thanks for the great hospitality. Oh my god. Man, these guys are leaving some really amazing reviews though. Wonderful. The sausage they serve here is delicious. Thank you for a lovely trip. I can't get enough of this island. All I did was sit around for seven days. All in all, it was nice. <laughs> These are just some really, really great reviews. Professor Guggins. Alright, well, um, that was funny. I cannot wait to see what else these guys are going to say after they're going to be done sitting here. Alright, next up then, uh, let me make my way to my home. Because as I was saying, guys, I really want to get uh, to the Mushroom Hunter. And I do want to start delivering all the mushrooms that we got on off screen. Uh, let me just pay this fellow, I guess, 50 coins to bring me a boat. Man, 50 coins is quite a lot, but that's fine. We got a lot. Look at this. We're so close to getting rich again. We almost got 2,500 coins, which is kind of insane to tell the truth. And while we're at it, can I also go ahead and catch me a fishy over here? Sure can. I think I want to start putting some fishes in the cooler as well at the island, just because these people might really enjoy eating some fishes there. Why not? Come on, buddy. There we go. We got a catfish. Awesome. All right, so next up, let me make my way to, as I was saying, the Mushroom Hunter. Try to give a, get a chat with them and uh, try to figure this out. I really want to see uh, what he's going to give us in return. Because I've completely gotten every single one of the mushrooms. I have nothing else to bring him anymore. Of course, he's still going to pay for them. So I'm still going to keep on bringing him as many mushrooms as I can. Oh my god, it's so difficult to park the boat in here. Uh, there we go. Perfect. And unfortunately, that fish got scared. I really wanted to catch him, but that's fine. Alright, buddy. I got your mushrooms. Can you give me something really cool in return, please? Let's see. Well, hello there. Have you got my mushrooms? Yep, let me rub much. Let's see, how much coin is gonna give me for this? Oh my god, 1500, 17, 1800. Are you kidding me? 1800 for these ones as well. Man, these mushrooms are paying so much money. 
every single time I'm gonna play this game, I'm not gonna even focus on going ahead and looking for mushrooms. I'm just gonna do random stuff. And whenever I'm gonna see a mushroom, I'm just gonna stop whatever I'm doing, grab that mushroom, and bring it back to this fella because, man, this is just gonna make us rich in no time. I and mean, look at this. This is just insane. I I don't even know if this is gonna change when the uh, I don't know if this is gonna change in the future if the uh, developers are gonna decide to reduce the prices, but. Oh my god, look at the prices. I love it. I don't know about you guys, but I think this is currently the best way to make a lot of money, Sneaky Sasquatch. Just whatever you do, stop, grab yourself some mushrooms, and get into this fella. 15,000 coins. Are you kidding me? That is insane. Whoa, that's a lot of coins. Don't spend it all in one place. Hey, let me see your mushroom guide for a second. Huh. Just as suspected, you collect every single one. Hmm, I'm so impressed. I like to pass along very special knowledge to your dog. <gasps> Wait, does this mean that he's gonna teach my dog to now start sniffing mushrooms? Oh, but I don't see one around. If you have one, please bring it to me and I'll train it. Oh my god, he's gonna train my puppy. Are you kidding me? Hold up, let me grab these mushrooms then. And uh, let me call for Pixel here. Oh man, this is gonna be so cool. So apparently he's gonna train my puppy to probably sniff some mushrooms. Is this gonna be like new mushrooms? I don't even know. Hey buddy! Of course you're hungry, I'm sorry. I I've neglected you for way too long. Let me give my buddy here a little bit of affection and also some food. Of course, uh, from now on we're also gonna start uh, running around with the puppy with us. Uh, because apparently, I'm gonna need the puppy to start finding more mushrooms. Are you serious right now? I really thought that was done. <laughs> I really thought that was done. Alright, buddy. There we go. There's a little bit of cheese. There's a little bit of cabbage. Perfect. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna start going out to the supermarket and filling up my backpack with random stuff. Because it looks like we are gonna need all this food in our backpack. As um, those guys that we're taking to the island, they're always gonna keep on asking. For random food from us. Alright, let's have a chat with this fella. Hopefully he's gonna teach my puppy. No, I don't wanna sit here. <laughs> I wanna chat with him. Alright buddy, we're ready. Teach us your secrets. Hmm, this is your dog over here, right? I'm going to train it so it can sniff out truffles. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I was actually talking about truffles in a previous episode. I'm wondering why the developers didn't add truffles to the game. But uh, look at that. They definitely thought about everything way before I did. They're worth a lot of coins. Oh my god, well, if the normal mushrooms are gonna worth are worth already a lot of coins, how much is the truffle gonna worth? You'll be as rich as a duck as uncle son. What? Oh my god, this is the best thing ever. <laughs> I love it how he trained them. Training complete. Your dog will be able to sniff up truffles now. I'll buy any white truffle or black truffle you bring me. Have fun. Are you kidding me? So I'm guessing in order to find these, um, we gotta do kind of the same thing that we did um, with the um, bones, right? Uh, we don't have to tell the puppy to search for them. All we gotta do is just run around randomly, and the puppy is gonna let us know when he's gonna spot them. I'm pretty sure about it. Hmm. Yeah, unfortunately, it's really late outside. I really wanted to go to the uh, town here to try to get me some more food because we're kind of out of food. Uh, but I think I'm gonna have to do that tomorrow. For now, let me just make my way, I guess, in town to the marina. And when we wake up in the morning, I think I'm gonna head on out into the supermarket, fill my backpack with a lot of random stuff, and uh, carry on from there, I guess. All right, let's do this. All right, good morning, everybody. Uh, now, I, I hope Pixel is gonna be here on the island somewhere, right? I know that he's kind of glitched out. He cannot really go on the uh, on the docks here. That's why he's not showing up. Uh, and unfortunately, I don't think I have any more food. Yeah, look at that. Pixel is right here. All right, buddy, hop on in. Hopefully, you're gonna let me know when you're gonna spot some uh, really cool mushrooms, some uh, truffles, because I really want to get myself some truffles. And of course, as I was saying, every single time I'm gonna spot some of these mushrooms, I'm always gonna stop from what I'm doing, go ahead and grab them, because uh, they're gonna be uh, worth a lot of money. And as this guy put it, in no time, we're gonna be as rich as a uh, duck's uncle. <laughs> all right, buddy, hold up. So first of all, let me make my way right over here. We are gonna have to do a little bit of uh, borrowing food, I guess, from this guy's fridge. There we go. We also have to feed our puppy. Because now that we're gonna have the puppy with us, running around with us, uh, we're definitely gonna need to get ourselves 
the puppy with us every single time, everywhere we're going. So that he can hopefully sniff out some mushrooms. That will be really good. Hey buddy, hold up. Let me just increase your heart here a little bit. I've definitely been neglecting Pixel here quite a lot. Not only that, but we haven't played uh, in this main save here for quite a while. And let me give you a little bit of food as well. Good boy. There you go. No, 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 don't eat my fishy. This one is worth 400 coins, buddy. I mean, I don't really care about this one anymore. Uh, fishies, uh, golden fishies sold to the trash bear are definitely not a thing. Are definitely a thing in the past. <laughs> Let me just grab myself some some uh, burgers and fries, and I'm just gonna hold on to these ones, just because people might actually request these. All right, thank you very much for the order. I'm gonna try not to eat these. I'm just gonna try to hold them on on me as we keep on going here. I'm also gonna try to fill my backpack with uh, tacos as well, just in case people are gonna start requesting them. Of course, when I'm gonna start taking people uh, to the island. For now. Let me just grab everything that I can from right over here. So we got two bananas. Let's go with three bananas. Three apples. I guess I'm also going to grab like three oranges. Why not? Maybe just try to grab everything. Uh, three of each. Alright. Uh, let me go with these as well. Why not? Alright. Uh, we're also going to need um, some duck. But maybe no, I don't think I need that. I think what I would need here, I also have to figure out what people are always requesting. Yeah, let's just uh, grab some canned food as well. Two of everything, just to make sure, I guess. Right, two mushrooms, two canned food like this. Right, two canned peas. Go. Maybe some coconut as well. I wish we could increase the size of our backpack so we can carry even more. <laughs> that would be really good. Alright, what about pizza? There we go. Definitely want some pizza here. Uh, I don't think eggs are going to be something that I need. Yeah, let's just not go with that one. And not that one either, but I do want to grab all this meat from over here. Not only because I want to hold on to all this stuff, but uh, yeah, the backpack is full already. But eventually people are going to start, but eventually I'm going to also have to eat up something as well. Alright, and we're off. Oh no! No, no, no! <laughs> we're fine. There we go, there we go, there we go. Alright, let's see. The puppy is with us. Unfortunately, he's not smelling anything. So, uh, I think I, what I'm going to do here, I think I'm just going to roam around with the puppy. And whenever he's gonna start sniffing some truffles, I'm gonna just stop over and uh, try searching for them, I guess. Now, while we're at it, let me also test out something. Let's just see what's gonna happen if I just exit the vehicle. And I tell Pixel here. Uh, let's see, how do I tell him to sniff out mushrooms? Your dog's about to search. If your dog smells something buried nearby, it'll bark and point towards the buried item. Head in that direction and keep searching until your dog finally uncovers the item he digs. Your dog will automatically search if you enter an area and there's something amazing nearby like a dinosaur bone. The winds shift each day, so try to visit the areas, search before, your dog just might pick up a new scent. So, apparently it's said that only the dog bones are amazing. Hmm. Okay, so the puppy is sniffing up something here. Let's see, is this how we're gonna be able to find the truffles or, or not? I don't even know. Let's tell him to search again. I was actually expecting the puppy to just let me know when he spots them, but I think that feature is only for the bones. Let's see. Is this going to be a truffle? Come on. Please be a truffle. That will be amazing. Whoa. I found a cash key. Oh, never mind. Yeah, I already know about this cash key. I kind of got confused there a little bit. <laughs> I got a little bit shocked. Is he gonna find more? Nope, he's definitely done with this area, yeah. Uh, yeah, so this cash key that we just found, uh, unfortunately there's nothing I can do with it because we already had it. Ooh, mushrooms! Thank you very much. Uh, but, I know that you can use this cash key to open up this thing. Wait, what? I already got in this one. 
Haven't I already gotten this one? Is this glitched? Well, that was weird. Does this mean that all the previous caches that we opened up before are gonna have coins in them? Because I'm pretty sure I already got the coins out of that one. That was so weird. Alright, anyway, I'm not gonna say no to some extra coins then. Definitely not gonna say no to some extra coins. Alright, buddy, so let's just keep on going then. Let me keep on making my way towards, I guess, the campground and try to uh, ask the puppy to search for some stuff over there. And while we're at it, why not stop on the road here for a second? And see, my puppy is gonna sniff out something on this side. Hey, buddy. Can you sniff something here? Let's see. Nope, nothing on this side. Alright, that's fine. Don't worry about it. Let's just keep on going then. Alright, so we got a bunch of mushrooms over here as well that we can go ahead and grab. Now, while we're at it, let me also tell my puppy to start looking. I really, really, really want to get myself some, uh, some of those truffles. As you guys know, in real world, truffles are really expensive, so I absolutely love it that they added this feature to the game. Ooh, even more mushrooms. Let's grab them. Now, I know that we keep on getting this animation like uh, we've never found it before, but we've already found all these mushrooms that we keep on finding. Uh, these are just copies that I really want to get just because they're going to be worth a lot of money. Alright, Puppy is not showing anything in this area, unfortunately. So next up is going to be the racetrack. But I also want to jump into a faster car here to try to... Oh my god, I did not want to do that. Sorry about that. Let's just get out of this area then. Right. Hey puppy, come here. I want you to start sniffing around for more... Uh, truffles, I guess. Nope, no truffles here. Never mind. In that case... Let's just look for some truffles on this side. Now, you know what I have a feeling? I have a feeling I may need to reset the day so that truffles do start spawning in. And while we're at it, let me grab these ones. There we go. I, I just noticed that these apricots are always spawning in uh, close to uh, shallow waters. Uh, let me tell them to search again again here, I guess. Any truffles? Nope, nothing. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to reset the day so that we can start getting ourselves some truffles. So let me go ahead and do just that, I think. I'm pretty sure once the day is going to be reset, it, um, we're probably going to start getting some new spawns showing up. Alright, there we go. New day. Hey, buddy. Morning, Rumi. Uh, let me go ahead and get something to eat for myself. I'm also gonna give my puppy some food as well. And I think I'm just gonna get rid of the uh, trash food over here. Why not? I mean, not the expensive ones such as the uh, golden fishies. I'm still gonna give those to the Samuel Bear whenever I get a chance. But for now, let's just grab, I guess, whatever food I can get. And also, let's just give our puppy some food as well. Uh, hold up, while we're at it, let me also tell him to search for stuff, I guess. Come here, buddy. Keep on searching. Look at that, we got some mushrooms over here. Ooh, actually, no, never mind. That's just a question mark. For a second there, I thought he spotted something. <laughs> yeah, buddy, that's fine. Don't worry about it. It's just a 4x4. So, next up, I think I want to start driving my... Yeah, you know what? Let's just go with this big thing. Why not? There you go, buddy. Ooh, mushrooms. <laughs> You guys are going to see me doing this every single time I'm playing Sneaky Sasquatch now. Just you watch. Ooh, mushrooms! <laughs> and again! Look at that! I knew it! Alright, let me uh, tell my puppy to start sniffing around here. Let's see if he can actually spot some good things for us. Where is he? Oh, there we go. <laughs> I was actually pushing him around. Nope! Nope, uh, nothing over there. I got some more mushrooms over here that I want to grab, so let me go ahead and get these ones as well. There we go. Thank you very much. I mean, I'm really curious to see where those uh, truffles are going to be located, though. It is not going to be easy, though. Let me tell you, I'm pretty sure we're going to have to search for these truffles for quite a while. Alright, nothing over here. Keep on going. 
So as I was saying, let me actually make my way into the campground because I feel like the truffles might actually be right over there somewhere. Alright, so we made it to the campground over here. Let me just tell my puppy to start sniffing around and see what he can find. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Uh, what we added, I think I've already... Oh no, I haven't petted him today. Interesting. How the heck did I do that? And I think I also have to give him a little bit of food here as well. Yeah, we're gonna be going through food like crazy now that we have to do all these missions. But that's fine. That is fine. We don't care about foods. All this stuff is meant to just go around with me because people are gonna start requesting it. And uh, I gotta figure out what type of food people are gonna start requesting when I'm gonna when I'm when I'm taking them to my island, just because I definitely wanna start selling them all that food. Alright, buddy. So next up, start sniffing. Please find some truffles. I really find I really really want to find some truffles today. Nope, nothing here. All right, that's fine. Let's just keep on going. Look at that. We're not finding any uh, truffles by doing this, but at least I'm finding random mushrooms absolutely everywhere. They're scattered everywhere. Keep on looking, buddy. And no bones over there, but again, we definitely have some truffles. Uh, not truffles, we definitely have some mushrooms over here. Oh, I don't want to put anything in there. Just, all I want to do is just drive. All I want to do is just drive and keep on finding more mushrooms. Okay, more mushrooms here, more mushrooms over here. Man, we're gonna get so many coins again. On and on and on. I don't even want to hear about any other strategies, guys. I have a feeling finding these truffles is gonna take a lot of time just because it apparently is not as easy. And as the hunter said, these truffles are gonna be worth a lot. Like in caps lock, lots of money. And if that's going to be a thing, then I'm pretty sure in order to find these truffles, we're going to have to do a little bit more searching than we had to do before. And it's also going to be very difficult because all you got to do is just keep on running around with a the puppy. They're just going to spawn in randomly and you're never going to know when there are going to be some uh, truffles around. So let, let me tell my puppy to start looking again. Ooh, look at that. He found something. And I'm guessing it's right here, right? Hopefully. Come here, buddy. Oh, wait. He found it. What is he doing? Come here. Oh. Oh, no. He pooped. <laughs> I was like, what the heck is happening? That's why he showed me the exclamation mark. Uh, whatever you do, don't go in the bush because I want to see you pointing. Aha. Uh -huh. So it's right here somewhere behind this tree. All right, puppy. Come on over. Come on over, show me where the, uh, hopefully, truffers are. Uh, wait, what? I'm guessing he's saying that the truffles are back here? Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure he's showing up here. So let me try it again. Uh, while we add it, let me also close this down. Maybe it's gonna fill up with coins again. <laughs> Similar to what the other, uh, to what the other chest did. Alright. Please be a truffle, please be a truffle, please be a truffle. Come on, come on, come on, give me a truffle. Is it gonna be a truffle? Ah, just a sack of coins. That's fine. That is good enough for me. I mean, look at that, guys. We already got 40,000 coins. Are you kidding me? And I haven't even struggled on trying to get all this coin. All I did is just play the game. That's all I did. This is the best thing ever. Definitely the best update so far, for sure. I wonder which one is going to be harder to find. White or black truffles? Alright, so he hasn't found anything, unfortunately. Hmm. Either way, you're definitely going to get yourself a lot of money because while running around, you're also going to find a lot of these mushrooms that are going to be worth quite a lot of coins. And look at that. We got a little bit more here. And a little bit more here. <laughs> Alright, buddy. What can you find? Nothing. That's fine. Don't worry about it. That is A-OK. -okay. Let me go through the forest then. Let's see if we can find something here. Although, I don't even know if uh, I'm going to be able to find anything here with the puppy. Ooh! Never mind! I was completely wrong. Are you kidding me? Alright, buddy. Uh, keep on looking. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to go with the boat somewhere, right? Yep. Right. Hop on in. Hop on in. 
There you go, buddy. And let's see where he actually spotted that. I guess it's gonna be somewhere on the right side here. At least I hope so. I just wanted to come through here through the forest because I, I thought I'm gonna find some more mushrooms. It doesn't look like there's that many mushrooms spawning in on this forest path here. You would have imagined that all the mushrooms, at least most of them, would be here, but it doesn't like it. Alright, let's see. Aha, huh, so he wants me to go back. Hold up, buddy. Let me just grab this mushroom on the tree. And by the looks of it, uh, let me also eat up something before I do anything else. Oh my god, the amount of stuff we have, though. I mean, it's not bad at all to have a backpack full of foods. <laughs> there we go. Alright. So, apparently, the puppy wants me to search around here somewhere. Come on, buddy. I know. Come here. Please give me a truffle. That would be so good. Exactly as the day is also passing. He did. He found it. Awesome. But again, we gotta hope that this is gonna be a truffle. I mean, it is close to a tree. So, maybe it is what I'm looking for. Come on, please be a truffle. Please be a truffle. <sighs> Just a can of pizza. <laughs> Gosh darn it, buddy. Come on. I really thought that was going to be a truffle. Alright, there we go. A brand new day has started. Let me just give a little bit of affection to Pixel here and as well as some food. And I think what I'm going to do, I'm also going to try to keep some tacos on me just because, as you guys know, people are kind of requesting tacos quite a lot. Let's give it a that. Let's give it a that. And we're good to go. And while we're at it, I'm also going to tell my puppy here to start searching. Let's see if he can sniff anything. Nope, unfortunately, nothing on the entire island. Alright, that's fine. Never mind. But, I am gonna go ahead and get myself some tacos from this fella. There we go. I just wanted to buy five of them just in case we are gonna eat a few by accident. I definitely have to have some tacos on me at all times. Really curious to see how much that dude is gonna pay when I'm gonna give him some tacos. Alright, let's see here. What about the marina? Is the puppy gonna sniff out something in this area? Okay, nothing over here, I guess. Let's keep her going. Alright, what about the side of the marina? Is he gonna find something here? I mean, this is a really, really small area that the puppy is gonna have to sniff out some stuff for me. Ooh! <gasps> ah, so where he's gonna sniff out the truffles, he's gonna let you know! Similar to what he's doing with the bones, I get it! Oh my god, we finally found the truffles! Man, I, I was actually not sure if I wanted to go here. But look at that! Alright, buddy, come on, come on over, come on over! I know that the truffles are going to be somewhere right here, so let me just tell them to search. Oh man, we found truffles! Are you kidding me? I'm really curious to see how expensive these ones are going to be. Oh wait, does he want me to go on the other side? Hmm... I think he does. Yeah, he definitely wants me to go on the other side, so let me just go ahead and do that. Thankfully, we do have the scuba diving gear for him, which is great. So let me just try to cross the river here, just like that. Alright, and now, let's just make our way all the way to the top because apparently... Yeah, I know, buddy. Come on over. I know you can smell it. I know. I know. So he's telling me to go up here. Which, it could probably be right behind this tree over here somewhere, or even higher. Search, buddy. And while you do that, let me also change my outfit here a little bit. Come on, puppy. Show me the truffle. Mm-hmm. So, he's probably wanting me to go, like, right about here. 
Oh, look at this path. That's an interesting one. Tell it to search. He found it. There we go. We got the truffle. Oh my god, this is epic. All right, let's see. So curious to see how this, how much this is gonna be worth. We did. Look at that. <laughs> you found a white truffle. There we go. Good job, buddy. Good, good job. Good boy. This is so cool. So apparently now we know, whenever you're going to be able to find these truffles, you don't have to tell your puppy to search for them. He is actually going to let you know when he's going to sniff them out, similar to what he does with the bones. All you got to do is just walk around with him, uh, visit different places, and eventually, he, if he is going to spot it, he is going to let you know. That is so good. Alright, well, now that we got the truffle then, let me make my way back home. There we go. Come on, buddy. Let's keep on going. Alright, uh, I gotta jump into the boat. Unfortunately, I don't think my boat is gonna be here anymore, so I'm gonna have to pay 50 coins to this fella to bring it to me. There you go. Man, this duck is gonna make a lot of money for me, eh? <laughs> Come on, puppy. I'm not gonna leave without you. There we go. Good job. And let's just see how many coins these truffles are gonna be worth. I have a feeling I'm gonna be shocked right now. It is not going to be easy, though, to find them. Let me tell you guys. It's definitely not going to be easy to find them, but... Why not just keep your puppy with you at all times? And whenever your puppy is going to spot them, just look for them. It's that easy. You don't even have to bother to look for them. The puppy is going to do the job for you. Alright, buddy. Well, hello there. Have you got any mushrooms? Yes, I do. So we also have the other mushrooms that we found as we were looking for the uh, truffle here. What? 2,500 coins for one single truffle? That is a lot! I mean, I think the price there was because it was new. I'm curious to see what the price is gonna be when it's not gonna be new. But either way, look at that! We got almost 5,000 coins uh, just with this run. And I think I've spent about uh, 25 minutes or something like that looking for that truffle. Yeah, that was definitely not bad at all. Alright, anyway guys, that being said, thank you all very much for watching yet another episode of Sneaky Sasquatch. And look at that, we have delivered all the mushrooms to this fella. We still have to find the black truffle though, and deliver it to him. But uh, we definitely completed the book, right, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, look at that, 100% completed. Because all of these mushrooms in the book right now, they've all been delivered. Uh, I don't see the truffles in the guide here, so these ones are not going to be considered as, as found or not. Uh, but uh, we at least know that we still need to find the black one and uh, deliver it to this fella. Man, this is always going to be the best way to make a lot of money, Sneaky Sasquatch. There's definitely no other way out there to get a lot of money, Sneaky Sasquatch, than this one. <laughs> Alright guys, thank you all very much for watching another episode of Sneaky Sasquatch. If you enjoyed this, please make sure you leave a like down below. If you didn't, dislike, that's fine. And if you guys are new here to the channel and have subscribed yet, go ahead and do that. Because I'm posting videos just like this one every single day. Playing many more indie adventure games and puzzle games I'm pretty sure you'll enjoy. And if you guys want to support the channel even more and become a member just like these fellas right here, go ahead and check out the join button at the bottom or the links in the description. And that being said, stay safe out there and I will see you all in the next one coming up really soon. Bye everybody! Ooh, mushrooms. <laughs> and again, look at that.